High U.S. inflation harkens back to the 1980s. It was July of 1982. Ronald Reagan was president. It was also the last time U.S. inflation was as high as it is now. All of those things contributed to higher and higher prices especially after the end of the Bretton Woods currency exchange system and the OPEC oil embargo unleashed a period of runaway inflation. Most of the recent inflation also has been spawned by what are likely to be temporary shortages of business supplies and labor, as lockdowns to combat the spread of pandemic-disrupted supply chains. In the past year and a half, meanwhile, Washington injected some $5 trillion into the economy in the form of stimulus payments to families and businesses to contain the damage caused by the COVID pandemic.